What is going on you lots? Midi here. A long time ago on TCM's first release, I had done a blood build with Hitchhiker. And on his trap ability, there is one thing that I've never ever used. I've used all family see noise, I've used the bleed damage, but what about bloody traps? So if a victim is caught in a trap, you will receive blood after resetting or collecting the trap. And I was thinking to myself, what if we create a blood build and then have this on? How well is it going to be? Well, I want to break the news to you really quickly. If someone walks into the trap and you end up resetting it, you only collect 20 blood. Yes, 20. We call that daylight robbery right here. But then I was thinking maybe if you increased his blood harvesting, maybe if we had like blood banker on, universal donor, or even siphon, surely then you would collect more, but it's still set as 20. But you know me, I'm going to try everything out at least once. We're going to jump into a complete blood build with the hitchhiker. We're going to make sure we got bloody traps on. And I won't lie, I've kind of missed using these blood harvesting builds. And I definitely think if you're playing with a duo, maybe your friend's playing as Kirk, Sissy, Nancy, and you're using universal donor, you can get granddad to five extremely fast. Yeah, you're going to be doing a little bit less damage in a game, but getting him to five straight away, and if you're able to put your traps near granddad that kind of seals the whole game for you sometimes so blood banker universal donor siphon we've got 26 points into the savagery just so we've got a little bit of damage we've got 50 points into the blood harvesting i know it's overkill now we're gonna jump into a few games with a complete blood build and then sometimes maybe we could change off siphon for maybe scout instead and see how we get on with that and this is the skill tree i use to get everything right here the ultimate blood build on hitchhiker it's almost giving me nostalgia using a blood build on old hitchhiker look at this geezer built like a pepper army stick let's get into a game right here we go First game of the day. The blood build is back. 182 blood, I'll take it. To be fair, Slaughterhouse little ain't too bad of a map because you've got a few blood buckets you can collect on the way. Gas Station 2 is quite a good map. Just any map where you spawn on the complete other side so you can actually collect the blood buckets. I mean, look at this. 182 blood, man. I know what you guys are thinking. Midi, why would you use the bloody traps? You're going to be getting no blood off of this. I oh, know. But that's all part of the experience, ain't it? To see what's a complete waste and what's not. Who knows? Maybe it'll clutch me. There we go. Look at that. Oh my god, 168 blood already. We ain't messing about here. Let's get the last one. There we go. So if you spawn on Slaughterhouse and get a little bit lucky with the blood buckets, 182 is really good. Hello, Connie. That's what I'm saying, though. That's the problem. I've not even put my traps down. You've already got Connie. You're already here. I don't know what she's hanging about. Do you know what? Ignore her. We need to feed Grandad. I'm sorry. Alright, that's done. Sweet. Door open. Wait. Oh! At... And get back up. Here we go. Get damage off. That's fine. Wait for it. Ooh, she's got to be one here. Another one stared into the trap as well. Wait for the slam. Wait. <laughs> she just didn't want to give up on that door, did you? Crap! Get door wars with me. Door wars don't happen. Now that's going to be another 182. Granddad. Already level 2 here. Oh my god. I think if you see anyone using Blood Banker and someone's just bled out on the floor, let them get the kill. Look at this. Let's get a trap down really quickly. See, I've not even put my traps down. Oh, no. Damn it, dude. Every time. I knew this was going to come. At least he's not using Agitator. You know, getting one level off Grandad is nothing. Nothing, Cleland, when you've got this kind of build, mate. If you put this one a little bit diagonally, when they come up through the basement, they actually end up walking into this. I learned that because I walked into someone's trap that's very similar to this. Okay. Good enough. Cook, you need to stay over at Battery Side, mate. I'll stay here. There we go. Level 3, bang. Look at that. Really? Now, look. 120 blood. And we're done. Now we can actually collect blood off the trap. Here we go. Did you look at that? Oh, my God. That should be buffed, I think, a little bit. Maybe if it was, like, 60 blood. That seems pretty fair. Because, look, how often are you going to get people walking into the traps? You're going to have to have five people walk into a trap just to get 100 blood. Doesn't seem worth it, does it? I don't know. Leading, you can fuck off. 
Oh, he might be using Empowered. Seems like it. Let him go. I'm just more worried about him messing about with Grandad right now. I'm pretty sure our leather face has quit the game as well, so it's just me and Cook. Listen, we can do this. Go on, you can go away, Leland. Let me collect the blood. More important. 120 blood, and he's going to be straight away max to 5. Now I can just sort of guard him, mate. Another three hits. As well, if you're running in blood type builds, get the hit off. Oh, mate, there's no weight. Oh! Oh, he's actually got it. Damn it, Leland. You do it every time, mate. You do it every time. Yeah, he's down. I mean, I don't know what you're planning, man. But whatever. Turn that off. Here we go. Time for five. Maybe they have gone through through generator side. We'll see. Here we go. I mean, the fact that I took Connie out straight away, I'm guessing it's going to slow the entire game down. Here we go. So I'm right next to Grandad. Okay. So the thing is, if I'm going to go chase her rear, Leland's just going to slap him again. Oh, shit. Running to me. Hello. Come on. Ooh, that might be an ability there. No. Listen, I've done the damage. I've got to watch out for this Leland, man. He's still in basement, and I think one was just running over to generate there. Let's double check. As long as I can collect 100 blood before he stabs him, we're good. Just wasting his time doing this. Here we go. Wait. Oh, right there. What are they doing? The Julie could actually go through to generator. Oh, no. Okay. Come on! No. Empowered. Damn it, Leland. You, you guys want to meme? I mean, it does become a lot harder. I mean, Cooks actually took out the Anna. Fair play. I don't know. Cook put the lot back on. Okay. Don't matter, mate. Leland, you can stab him as much as you want, mate, but he's constantly going to be level 5. Right, Cook's gonna get him to five sweets. Yeah, double check everything, we good. The ultimate blood build coming into effect. I told you guys, man. For some reason, these guys. I don't know. I would have just thought they would have left by now. Let's check again with five. Alright. I see you, Julie. I reckon take Julie out of the game, we're good. At this point, Leland's doing nothing but stabbing Grandad. Oh no. Not good. Again, Julie. I just wanna talk, mate. I just wanna talk. That's it. And she goes, she actually lost me. Wait. Alright. That's Leland. He's committed to the valve, bro. Why are you doing it? Get Oh no. Not this! God could beat him there. Beat! Beat him there, mate! Come on! Oh no, he might be dead. Come on, come on. What's going on? Mate, there is no way he's just eating all this damage. What? I've got almost full blood just from attacking him. That's mad. Surely he's bled out from that. No notification that he bled out. What is going on with that damage, by the way? Is my savagery just that low? These guys are just trolling at this point, I think. That's perfect. I should win this. You ain't beating me. You ain't beating the click master or my Xbox controller, all right? Just accept it. Ain't no way. Come on, Leland. Oh, go to barge. Cook, that is all you, mate. This Leland is just eating damage. I don't know what to say. Wait. Yep. Finally. Give me that finger, mate. Come on, Cook. I can't believe how much damage he ate back then. That was ridiculous. No cell, extra drip, and empowered. Sorry, but it deserves a tea bag. At the minimum, it deserved a little bit of a tea bag there. GG though, not bad for first game on the blood bill. Finally, after eons, after years, we actually get Nancy's house. I can't tell you guys how many times I've had to play Family House just to get this map. Now, I'm not sure if this is going to work yet, but I was planning this way ahead of time. 
You see this little light spot? The little square light spot? Surely this is going to camouflage the trap. Okay, maybe, maybe not, but a little bit. I just feel like it's in one of them areas where if people aren't paying attention, they're going to walk into it. That was my plan. Some of you guys are going to say, you know what, Midi, that was really good. And some of you are going to laugh. I'm waiting for it. Okay, right. We're not doing any sort of basement chasing here. We are straight up collecting all of the blood. Hopefully, Leadface can get a pick on one of them. Collect the blood. Then maybe we can put a few traps down. Don't forget as well, we want to collect the blood from the traps. So I'm going to have to put them in very devious spots today. Going to go for the old classic. As I quit. Normally they can't see this if they sprint around the corner. But it's almost a common spot now that most players are going to check it. There you go. Let's collect the last bit of blood right here. Get a feed on Grandad. Try and get some of these perks activated already. The last trap, I normally am going to put it somewhere near Grandad. I'm thinking about putting it in between the gap though. There you go, Baldy. Drink it up. Lovely. Now, it's kind of going to be a little bit of a sneaky trap. Wait, let's go around the other side here. There we go. It's just for if they go through the other side, they're going to walk straight into it. Let's see. It's a little bit devious. Right, nice. Sunny's out. Double check this door. Are right, we good? Oh, we get into fight there. Let's go. Let's just hope the trap at the gate is actually gonna get. Oh, left face is there. Wait, he's gonna come straight through here. Oh, could have put it by the door. Wait. Yes, he goes to well. No, he ain't. That's easy trap. Left face. All you, mate. All you. All you. All you. Almost. Almost. If I had the increased escape difficulty, he was dead there for sure. Okay, he's gone. Vanished. Damn, maybe I should change it. Let's reset. We had just a little bit more time there. Maybe Leadface ain't using Scout. Give us our 20 blood. Gets me to 100, which is going to proc the second poke. Hey, listen, it all adds up. Lovely. Well, that trap's still there, which is good. At least I can keep track of that. Okay, you've got a few in basement. Kind of need Cook to come round, really. I don't know if he's collecting blood here. That right, gate's good. 42 blood per bucket, mate. That's not bad. Look, even when it's not fully recharged, you're still getting quite a lot out of it. Alright, so if we get, it's like 105 blood and we're going to go up two levels here. Straight to four and then one of them can finish it. And we've got a few spawned right here. Alright. One more blood bucket or a few attacks on someone. Yeah, so we're still good here. There we go. That's going to be level four and then one of them can finish it. I guess that's the only thing you got to watch out for. If they've still got Leland or Anna in the game, just be warned that they are going to come for old Baldy over here. You get out or you'll get it worse. Pretty much now. We've got three decent perks up. Lovely. Hoping that one of them have 100 blood. Surely they do. Check garage side quickly. Hey, Liv. Okay, yeah, Cook's fine. Seems all right. Yeah, look, Cook's going to finish it off. Perfect. Uh, Julie might be going for the slab there. Wait. Oh, she definitely is. There's no way. Cook. Cook, why are you looking at me standing there? Go on, bigger. Go on, mate. Wow. Here's me thinking about the Leylands. Instead, it's the Julie. Oh, yes. That's free kill. Yes. Good job, Cook. Just stood there. I mean, she's still got a stab on him. Then straight away went into a cutscene with the Cook. I don't know. It's weird. Weren't worth it, though. Look. He went down one level and I got 182 blood for that. Oh, What? Just vacuumed him from the other side. That's crazy.
And I see Connie. Hey, what is this deal, mate? They're all going around Grandad, mate. There's no way. Oh, she's gone for the stab. Yep. Come on, go through gap. Yep. All right. Don't miss this time there, face all you. Oh! Dead. Sayonara. Look at Cook having a little old wonder. What'd you see, Cook? <laughs> ah, the memes. So good. I actually missed using this build. I think when you start getting Grandad to level four, they start to panic and actually realize they've got to stab him. All right, family house. We changed it this time. I've actually put on scout this time. And you know what we're going to do? We're not going to put the trap outside the front door. No. We're going to put it in the spot that you guys keep telling me to. By the window. Let's see if it actually works. And let's get it right here. Good enough. I mean, look, you guys tell me to do it. I'll do it. I'll try it out. Now, guys, I do tell you, if you are family main, if you see someone with Universal Donut, especially on Family House, don't take the blood. Yeah, there's not that many blood buckets to go around, but at the same time, you could go to basement if you want to, if you're waiting for them to sort of recharge. Okay, we've got Johnny here. Try and get him to 100 so they can go down. Never mind. Now, we don't have a cook, so I'm going to have to get his tramp right here. There we go. Just in case. They rush. So this is a little bit different this time. We've got a sissy. So I've had to put the trap right there. Still good for doors. Got to figure out where the fuse box is because I've only got one trap. Okay, perfect. See, the fact that the fuse has spawned here is kind of good for me because I can just use one trap for upstairs. Normally you end up trapping out the stairs, but this time put it right here. Now, this should just be in range that if they go through the gap, they're going to walk into this. And... Sunny's out. Perfect. Latch the door as well. Make it a little bit harder for him. Alright, good. I'm just going to get a feed on him really quickly. Oh, this is what you got to watch out for. That is especially what you have to watch out for. And I see Anna there as well. Get out. Come. I actually kind of miss the fact that my blood's not like 180. It's 160. Just seems to refill it a little bit quicker. Oh, no. It all adds up for me. There we go. Oh, I've got Windoom now. Good. So, like, yeah, you're collecting 36 blood instead of the 42. Is it worth it? I oh, no. Still a few blood buckets around. Getting a little bit slower though. See, I would have thought it was sissy. Oh, I don't know, actually. It's just me collecting blood, isn't it? There we go. See what I mean? Once you know where every single blood bucket is or where they can spawn, blood builds do become a lot more effective. What are you doing? Oh, what's going on here? Oh, no. Found a bit of banter, ain't I? The old classic banter of knocking each other out the doors. I don't know if there's a family feud there. Whatever. There we go. I mean, I'm just going to trust in my trap there. Let's check around the corner. Nope. These guys are playing so slow. Do none of them have bomb squad on? Is that why? That is what I've noticed. Like, if you play against some players and they're just messing around with funny builds, if someone's not got Bomb Squad on, it just slows the game down. Okay, yeah, look, traps are still good. Let's go straight down. Look, that's about 150 blood and it's going to be level 5, so let's do it. The other guys are just being really slow about it. I know roughly where a lot of them do spawn. I mean, I never click blood in the basement as leather face. Oh, there we go. Just use Killer Instinct to find them. There we go. Ooh, someone's just landed. Who is it? Oh, my God. Would you look at that? Ooh! That was with Scout. If I didn't have that, maybe wouldn't have catched her in time here. Oh! Give me that finger. Who is it? Added. 
to the collection. Okay, now should be fine. I've noticed that always happens with me. So, like, I'll be collecting blood in the basement. Ooh. Just had one. Oh, well, let's just get the feed quick. Just before. I always stand here for a second as well. Just in case anyone tries to attack me. I mean, these guys are playing way too slow. Oh, that's where she was. She was in the hiding spot. Wow. See, I would have never have known. The killer instinct went off. Get down. I just am. All the doors have been barged by Johnny. Thank you. Oh, she's going for it, mate. Straight window. You're at. You're at. Come on. Ooh, she missed trap. What's going on? Last left, mate. Mate. You're at. I don't know what happened there. I think if you want to jump out the window as Anna, you are always going to make sure you've got your ability ready, you know? Your ability ready with bone knives. But look at that. Two fingers, I'll take. Thank you very much. You guys can let me know about two things. Number one, blood builds. Number two... Is it worth having bloody traps on a hitchhiker? Probably not. Catch you lot later.